when um, I tell anyone that I'm in nursing school, I explain that I'm going to school full time and they're always asking me where, where do you go to school and I tell them I go to Kansas City, Kansas Community College as well as KU. It's a dual program where I'm able to do my associate's degree on campus and my bachelor's degree online. When we first heard the idea for starting this partnership program, there was a lot of um, backlash, a lot of we can't possibly do this, it's impossible, you can't award a bachelor's degree from a community college. Then, you know, the more we started thinking about it and breaking it down bit by bit, instead of thinking of obstacles, we started thinking, well, why not? Why can't we do this? Instead of doing their associate degree program, and then going on and having to do an RN to BSN program uh, after finishing their associate degree, they are now able to uh, complete their BSN requirements uh, as the online portion while they're doing their on the ground provider of care portion of the BSN with their community college. The partnership with KU is allowing me to get my bachelor's when I graduate from the ADN program. So it's incredibly convenient. I'm basically doing the RN to BSN program at the same time as the ADN program. If we can provide an opportunity for students to earn both their associates and baccalaureate degree at the same time, then they're already starting out with that higher degree. Uh, they go into practice and the other part of it is just it does it opens up other opportunities professionally for students as well. Most hospitals are looking to hire um, new graduates that have BSNs as opposed to regular associate's degree in nursing. This program helps me by giving me a BSN right out of the gate. It was the best thing for me. It allowed me to apply for more positions because I have a bachelor's degree. There were so many positions that I was eligible to apply for as a new graduate because of the partnership program. Students also ask about the cost. How much is this going to cost me? What tuition do I pay? And that's really one of the huge advantages of the program is you pay community college tuition for all except for 30 credit hours. I get to take my prerequisite classes at Johnson County Community College paying their tuition rate, which is saving me thousands of dollars. For those students who know that this is, this is their goal, this is their dream, um, that they want to pursue both the associate and bachelor's degree at the same time, why shouldn't we offer that opportunity? When students choose a school, they choose the school that feels like home to them. And for, you know, a lot of students all over the country, that home, that feeling of home is at a community college. The uh, community college faculty has been very supportive in helping me obtain my goals. Anytime that I have issues, they always encourage me or send me to the right people to help me get through to the next level. The faculty supports our decisions to go to KU. They often will ask us about some of the things that we're learning and will allow us to draw in some of those items such as leadership and evidence-based practice research. We focus more on hands-on clinical exemplars in, at the community college level in our program on the ground there. So when there is options to do case studies, it's great to be able to pull in some of those things. You hear things like the novice nurse and the expert nurse, and these are all things that you learn in the program. And the first time that I heard that, I went, thank you, Dr. Martin, because I was prepared. If we're going to meet the increased need for healthcare providers of all types, we have to be innovative in educating. And to see this program expand and to see the traction it's gaining nationally is incredibly uh, heartwarming and gratifying. We were told many times it wouldn't happen, that it couldn't happen, there's no way it can happen, and we just stuck with it. And with persistence and continued grit, we just kept working through it, and it's a reality today. I would love to have every community college in Kansas involved, and maybe even beyond that. If a student is out in Hutchinson, Kansas, and gets their BSN, and wants to pursue further education, it's a shorter time period, it's closer to doing that. And they've also never left their their hometown. So they stay in Hutchinson this whole time. They still have those close ties to the community college. And I would like to see students returning there and teaching there with their advanced degrees. A lot of the students that I'm with now are obtaining their ADN. And then after they get their ADN, then they're gonna have to go back and get their bachelor's degree. I feel like I'm a step ahead by obtaining them both at the same time. 
overall, everyone that's in the program with me, they're really excited. It's an amazing opportunity. You're combining the RN to BSM program with the ADM program. What's not to like about that? And when you walk down that hill at your graduation, it is the best feeling ever.